map out your octaves and your unisons. This is how you move the same note groupings across the whole guitar neck. Let's start with the octave on a single string. If you play the open of any string, the 12th fret of that same string is the octave. You also have octaves on adjacent strings. And when you do adjacent strings, the octave is on the seventh fret of the higher string. So if I start on low E again, the octave of E is on the seventh fret of the A string. And that is the same across all of your strings, except G to B. G to B is always the exception. You have to move up a fret. So the octave is on the eighth fret of the B string. And when you get back to the B string going to the high E string, it's a seventh fret octave again there. Now your unisons, that's the same note in two different places on the guitar neck. So for example, fifth fret of the low E is the same as open A. And again, that is the same across all of your adjacent strings except G to B. You have to move the G string note down a fret. So it's fourth fret G, open B for your unison. You just get a better understanding of the entire fretboard and how to move around it if you know your unisons and your octaves. If you learn that, you're gonna be in really good shape. Go try it out.